Peekaboo is a playful song that is perfect for playing the classic peekaboo game. Young children love to play peekaboo, and this song gives plenty of opportunity to play over and over again. Stay tuned until after the song to learn some fun activities you can do with peekaboo. Now let's get started. Peekaboo, peekaboo, peekaboo. I see you. Peekaboo, peekaboo. I see you. Peekaboo, 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 peekaboo. Peekaboo, I see you. Peekaboo, peekaboo, I see you. Peekaboo, 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 peekaboo. That was peekaboo. A simple and effective way to use this song is to play the peekaboo game. This game is especially fun for young babies and perfect for a mommy and me type class. Caregivers can cover their eyes, then say peekaboo. You can also use props like a colorful scarf to hide your face or hide your little one's face. Try covering the eyes or the face of a stuffed animal. Ask your little one where the stuffed animal went. Then, peekaboo, reveal the stuffed animal and enjoy the giggles. For slightly older students, use peekaboo as an introduction for other hide and seek games. We have a cat character that plays peekaboo in our peekaboo videos. You can try hiding several images of a cat around the room and have your students find them. Bring all the cats together and count how many you found as a group. Try making a peekaboo cat craft like this one from Super Simple. Peekaboo! Your students can play with their craft as they sing the song. Peekaboo! Peekaboo can also be used to create some excitement when introducing new vocabulary with flashcards. Try revealing a little bit of the flashcard at a time while singing peekaboo, like this. Peekaboo, peekaboo, peekaboo. Then reveal the whole card and say, I see you. This adds a little extra fun when working with flashcards. We hope you enjoy peekaboo. Keep on singing, learning, and having fun. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out supersimple.com for more songs and resources. If you have any ideas on how to use this song in the classroom or at home, let us know in the comments below. And be sure to subscribe for more teaching tips.